Hey guys, uh, very, very quick. I'm recording this in between episodes. I am actually on a Fire Red account gathering Pokemon so I can trade them to my main. So right now I am literally leveling up this Geodude to get it to Graveler so I can trade it to Golem. And Shiny Spearow. Um, I've... This is like kind of crazy. I've never had a shiny Pokemon before in with, you know, not Pokemon Go in this. And I just looked up and I'm like, it's shiny. So it's kind of weird because it is not in my main game. This is Fire Red. This is a whole different game. And this is literally just a feeder game. Um, Like this is not like I don't consider this a real game. I'm just literally I need to. I needed the other version to get the Pokemon that are unobtainable. Um, but I'll probably end up trading over this uh, shiny Spearow while I'm at it. Um, just because, like, wow, this is, like, shiny Spearow, you know? On my game is also, I even muted it just because, like, you know. There we go, shiny Spearow. Very um interesting. Full odds, full odds shiny Spearow. Um, no. Okay, well, anyway, I'm gonna keep grinding. Um, very interesting. Hey everybody, we're playing Pokemon again. We're just about to go into the Rock Tunnel, but before we go, um, I want to do a few things. Obviously, you guys know I'm playing on an emulator, therefore, there are certain exclusive Pokemon to Fire Red, and there are certain Pokemon that only evolve when trading. Well, it just so happens that... Um, basically all three of the Pokemon that only evolve through trading happen to be my favorites that I want to use and I obviously want to use the final evolution. So here's what I did. Um, in between episodes, I made a new fire red account. I went ahead and got all the Pokemon that I needed because they really, really need to be like level 28. It's really not that hard. And I have that account. And now through my emulator, I will be trading for those Pokemon so I can have them. Um, and once again, they were legitly caught in fire red, therefore um, I'm not spawning them in, I'm not cheating, they were legitimately caught, and I'm just trading them to myself, and we're going to be doing that right now, because again, a lot of those Pokemon I really, really want um, in my Leaf Green playthrough. So we're going to go ahead and do that now. So you can see here that I have um, my main Leaf Green big game out front, and then I have the little Fire Red on the side, just so you guys can see. So let's go ahead and go through this trade process. we got to go over to this lady over here. Welcome to the Pokemon Cable Club. Which one of our servers do you wish to use? I'm going to go ahead and leave that there. Okay. Um, right now, I am on the Fire Red on the left. Welcome to the Pokemon Cable. So, we're going to go and trade. And we're going to click yes. And we're going to go back, trade. We're going to click yes. 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 Okay. So, both of them are saving. And then it should theoretically let us. And also, I have the games muted because there's two games. Please wait. Okay, so now we're waiting. Waiting link up. All right, here we go. Uh, here we go again. So, um, and this time I'll actually show you guys uh, what I'm trading. Okay, got to go over to Fire Red. Okay, please wait. So, here's what I'm going to be trading. Um, basically, um, the three Pokemon that need to be traded to evolve, Kadabra, Graveler, Machoke, and then I gathered two Leaf Green or Fire Red exclusives, Oddish and Ekans. Um, and then I will probably grab the Charmander. And then that's all I'll trade for now. And in a future episode, we will grab the exclusive Water Pokemon and some of the later ones. But I just wanted to grab the three that I know I needed and just a couple of the early game exclusives. And we'll take care of the rest later. So let's go ahead and... Um, Okay, so I am on I'm on the right here. So we'll go to trade that one. And then we'll go ahead and trade Kadabra. Oops, okay, I don't want a summary. I just want to trade. So there we go. Um Yes. Yes. And then we're gonna go ahead and trade all six of them slowly. Alright, see so yep, I'm getting rid of my Geodude and my Leaf Green. And I will be getting back a Kadabra. 
And again, this whole process is going to take a little while because i got to trade all six. And eventually, later in the game, we're, we will be trading more because um, there's more exclusives and stuff. But for now, we'll start out with six. Okay, so we got the Kadabra. And now, I don't know if sh it might evolve later. Yep, okay, so it actually it just evolves right away. Okay, so I'm guessing the other guy needs to just sit here and wait while our Kadabra evolves into an Alakazam. Perfect. Beautiful Pokemon. And this is, again, one that I definitely want to use on my team. Um, same with the Machamp. And I don't know about the Golem, actually. Probably not the Golem. Maybe I'll just use um, the Alakazam and the Machamp. Because those are two that are like super sick. Like Who doesn't want to use those two at the end of the game, you know? Now, question, will it kick me out or will it let me do another trade? Okay, so it will let me do another trade. Okay, so let's go ahead and give the Voltorb. And then on here, we're going to go ahead and give the Machoke. I keep clicking Summary. Okay, and then Trade. Trade, yes, yes, yes. Okay, cool. All right. We're sending over the Voltorb. And we're going to get back Machoke. I could probably turn on the audio for one of these. Okay. Um, very, very jank audio, but I feel weird just talking with absolutely nothing, so. And once again, I want to make sure to reiterate that the Pokemon were caught legitly. I played the game up until the point to catch them with, you know, real Pokeballs. These are real Pokemon. I did not, uh you know, spawn them in, anything. These are legit Pokemon. So that's why um, I quite literally just have two accounts and I'm trading between accounts and that's simply it. There we go. We got ourselves a Machamp. And again, I, because I have two uh, windows open, it's a little laggy. So that's why the sound is very weird. Um, so hopefully you guys don't mind that a little bit until we can just get these things traded. And then we can kind of, we can just honestly get back to the game because this is, that's one thing about Pokemon games that it, I really wish there weren't version exclusives, but the reality is there are, and we have to, I had to jump through these hoops to get the Pokemon that I wanted, you know? Our right, next one, we're gonna go ahead and Graveler. Why did I, okay, so let's go ahead and click that, trade. Trade okay, yes, trade okay, yes. So, I really wish I didn't have to jump through these hoops just to get Pokemon that I want. Um... But, it is what it is, and we will play by the rules that we can, and this will work, and we will get the Pokemon that we want. So we're, we're, we're a good ways into getting all the Pokemon that we actually wanted, you know, so once again, Machamp, Alakazam, um, we're not going to get Starmie for quite a little while, and then Graveler is evolving, here we go. And then we got three more to trade. Okay, guys, all the trading is done. We are back in my world on my normal, actual Leaf Green playthrough. Let's go take a look at what I just did. If we go to my Pokemon. We have Alakazam. We have Machamp. Golem. I grabbed the Charmander, or technically the um, Charmeleon, Oddish, and Ekans. So, and again, these are not crazy levels. You know, 29, 28, 25. Um, 35 is maybe a little high, but not really... Most of these are actually the exact same level where we are at right now. So, I think it's all in fairness. Alright, so that is the clip. Um, I actually didn't end up grabbing that Spearow, but I will grab that Spearow probably uh, the next time we do the big trading. But, 
Uh, now, I want to jump back into the leaf green. I got the Pokemon that I really, really wanted. So let's go ahead and jump back in. So let's go ahead and um, kind of fix our party here. Um, so I'm not going to need Ekans. We can sort in box one. I'm not going to want Oddish. Um, I'm not going to need Charmeleon. So I'm not going to be using Char uh, Char uh, Charizard in this playthrough. I really don't want to use any of the stars. Even Blastoise, I'm probably going to get Blastoise and then I'll probably get rid of them. Um, but I will probably... I'll probably keep Golem. So let's go ahead and withdraw. Now we got to decide what, what three... Because we had six Pokemon, so now we kind of got to decide what we no longer want. So these are the six that we have. I'm going to keep Nidoking. Um, probably Pidgeot. And then I really have to decide between Wartortle or Weepin' Bell. And honestly, I think I'm going to keep Wartortle for now. So this is what our team is going to currently consist of. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and move Wartortle to the front. So we're going to have Wartortle, Machamp, Golem, Nidoking, uh, Pidgeotto, and Alakazam for now. Now let me see if I can teach him any moves because a lot of these Pokemon don't have very good moves. Um, TMKs. So let's see what I got. Thief, no. Attract, no. Secret power, can I? Okay, let's go ahead and teach it to Alakazam. Because he doesn't have many other moves. And actually, I don't have any psychic moves. Aerial Ace. Um, let's go ahead and teach it to Pidgeotto. Um, yes. So let's go ahead and remove... Um, probably Tackle. We don't need Tackle here. Alright, so he forgot that. And he's going to learn Aerial Ace. Okay. Rock Tomb. Probably give that to... Give it to either of them. I'd, let's probably give it to Golem. Yes. Uh, which move should be forgotten? Probably Mud Sport. I don't need Mud Sport. And of course, this isn't my final team. It, it could still be subject to change. Honestly, I'm not 100% set on Golem, and I'm not really... And again, I don't really want the Blastoise in the end. So this is nowhere near um, done. I'm going to teach Brick Break to Machamp. Um, no. Yes, I do want to keep pressing the wrong buttons. Yes, okay, which move should be forgotten. Um, we should probably get rid of... Um... Let's get rid of low kick. Honestly, like low kick is cool, but eh, it's very niche. Okay, we could use dig. Who can learn? We should probably teach dig to golem here. Um, and then we could probably bulldozer herd. Probably get rid of tackle. Let's go ahead and get rid of tackle. That's fine. Okay, learn dig. Okay, I think we're good. Um, Needle King. Okay, so let's go ahead and go inside the rock tunnel. And funny enough, I still need to catch him a chop. <clears throat> that is something we still need to do. Um, and I think the other one that we need to catch in here is um, also Onyx. Let's go ahead and use Flash. That should light up the place a little bit. And also, let me quickly... Alright, here we go. Okay, let's go ahead and move on with the game here. And once again, we just really need Onyx and Machop. And let's go ahead and we could probably... Let's just tackle it so we don't kill it. Okay, karate chopped. Critical. And even that critical did like nothing. Okay, now I need War Turtle to not crit it. Dude, my guy War Turtle has a real problem with critting at like very much the wrong times. 
which is like I, good in like battles but see like now I'm gonna have to like go ahead and find it again it's like oh man I right, water gun the geo dude <clears throat> but I'm really really happy that I got my champ and Alakazam because they're definitely like my one of my my favorite evolution lines that I really don't didn't want to play the game without and I'm super glad that the trading between emu emulators wasn't that hard either which that makes me just as happy I thought it'd be I thought it'd be maybe like a really hard process but it really wasn't um, as long you know I had to play the other game to get caught up but other than that you know it wasn't crazy hard so that's good and we'll keep War Turtle up just because I do want to get Blastoise um, again I don't know what's gonna happen with the future Blastoise I don't think I'll keep them um, yeah, I don't think I'll keep him, but we'll see. Oh man, it was like so close. Oh, but it flinched. That's perfect. All right, well, let's hit it with the tackle. Just to get rid of that red HP. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -bum. Okay. And then once again, we'll, we'll just get him a chop and an onyx along the way. Zubat, that is definitely not something that I need. But a water gun the poop out of you. There we go. Oh, I could also use my bike. I always I always forget that I can use my bike. It's a very bad habit. Alright, water gun. And we will bring out some of, uh, some of the other Pokemon later. For now, I'm just going to keep War Turtle up front. Alright, let's see. Where did we land? I'm just trying to take a look at the map here. So we're probably in floor 2. Okay, so we're at the bottom. We have another battle here. I draw illustrations of Pokemon when I'm home. Oh, good for you, bud. One. Slowpoke. Okay, that's it. That's all you got, Slowpoke. I mean, I'm glad. Very glad. Let's hope I can maybe one-shot you. Oh, no way I one-shot. Yeah. Ah, but you punched again. Right, let's go ahead and tackle you. Send you to the Shadow Realm. Level 32. Here we go. Defeated Winston. Got some money, too. Alright, Mankey. Oh, man, so no, where's the Machops at, man? Where's the Machops at? Ooh, that was a, that was a quick encounter. Alright, there is a Machop, level 17, a little higher. And then War Turtle, please just don't crit this time. Okay. Karate chopped. No crit, War Turtle. No crit. Okay. Exactly what I needed. Go ahead and throw a ball. And I do need I need to buy more Pokeballs too. I neglected to buy some. I have a lot of money, so there's no reason why I don't buy any. I guess I'm kind of waiting for the Great Balls to come, but I don't know. I don't know if I get those at Cerulean or Vermilion. Or not Ver we were at Vermilion. Or, uh. Loves to build its muscles and trains all styles of martial arts to become even stronger. Or at, at Lavender. Okay. Well, anyway, um, that is just basically the Pokedex Machop. Um, ooh, a revive. That is rare, so I'll have to keep that. Don't know if it come here, but I will battle you. Alright, so all we have left is the Onyx, which is a uh, 5%. So, not high at all, but I'm, I'm sure we'll, we'll do it. Well, the Oddish is not a good one to fight. Let's go ahead and bite it. See if we can maybe... Oh. Oh, critical. Okay. War Turtle is all about getting crits. About to use Bulbasaur. Yeah, let's go ahead and switch out. And let's switch to a new Pokemon. Let's go to Machamp. Let's get our first battle with Machamp going. It's a pretty weird sprite, but fair enough. Why is it like sideways? Um, okay, let's go ahead and use Brick Break. So, 
not very effective and it still was that strong. That's pretty nuts. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this. Um, not a fan of the sprite. But fair enough, I guess. Alright, try to chop it. And then hopefully I have an antidote in my bag to get rid of this poison because I don't want my Machamp dying. Level 29. Okay. Screw you, Martha, for uh, poisoning me right before I left. Antidote. Oh, yeah, I bought some more. Okay. Alright, Machamp. There we go. Now let's keep moving on. Yeah, it, like I said, I, we're probably going to get to the end of it, and then I'll probably just have to um, look around for the Onyx. Because it's not going to be an easy one to get. Oh, do you know about Pokemon cosplay? Uh, I mean, yeah, in a sense. I don't know what type of cosplay this dude's into, though. Looks a little weird. Oh, I'm a water type. This is sick. It's Charmander. This is like a perfect matchup. Yeah, and then I did, like I said, I brought over the Charmander from my other game. I will also, I will probably have to make a third one to get Bulbasaur. Um, but I will do that once again at a later date, partly because I have absolutely no interest in Bulbasaur. That literally might be the last Pokemon I get for the Pokedex because it's Bulbasaur, like... Yeah. Which I know many of you are probably going to get terribly mad at me for, but I just very much dislike Bulbasaur. Alright, it looks like we got a few, few battles. Okay. Gonna water gun you. So we got two different trainers, and then we have a ladder. So let's go ahead and beat both of them very, very quickly. And I will fight both of them. I know you only I only need to fight one, but I will fight both. I just hope they don't have like seven Pokemon each. Okay, only two. That's not bad at all. I think that's doable. Alright, go ahead and use water gun. Alright, didn't kill it. Okay, we could probably just use a tackle. If a tackle doesn't kill it, I'd be very surprised. About to use Onyx. Now we can we can keep um, War Turtle out. So you can use Water Gun again. And I think Water Gun will kill this just because it's a rock type. Yeah. yeah oh, oh, and it's, and it's critical. Critical, super effective. Yeah, that could that would have been like a could have been a level 40 Onyx. That probably still would have killed it instantly. Let's make sure we fight. Oh, we fight this guy. The Pokemon techniques will leave you crying. Alright, bud. Oh, only one. Good. Um, and in my other game, I also did grab the uh, Helix Fossil instead of the other one, so I will also do that. Go, oh, super effective. Level 33 War Turtle. And we might be able to get Blastoise very, very soon. Oh, encounter right before, but it's gonna be an Onyx. Uh, Sight. Another Zubat. Throw a water bubble at you. We're back at floor one, right? Yep. Okay. Well, we got three. I think we got three trainers to beat on this level. And I'm ru I'm running low on water gun PP, so I'll have to be a little careful here. Um, we should probably should go up and beat this guy first. I know I just like walk past them, but I should beat this guy first. This tunnel goes a long way, kid. Yeah, I can tell I've had to fight already a million of you. Oh, he has four. Why do you have four, dude? Why do 
you gotta torture me like that, man? Four of them. And they're all low level. Oh, okay, come on, get it over with. It's late at night, man. Um. Bring out Alakazam. Let's see what Alakazam can do. Maybe not a good idea against Rock, but whatever. I love Alakazam with his little spoon. I got my spoon. He's staring intently with his spoon. Um, probably do a secret power. Okay, now I forgot normal's not effective. Please don't destroy my Alakazam. What about shock? Oh, electricity's not gonna work either. No! Alright, Alakazam was not, isn't coming out super impressively. I'm just gonna be 100% honest. Alright, well, um, that's fine. Golem. Let's see what Golem can do. Alright, we don't even see Golem. Where's his head? I can't tell what's his head and what's his arm. Let's throw a rock at him. I know it's not gonna be effective, but yeah, okay, never mind, guys. Alright, let's uh, shove all these cool Pokemon back in our party here and let's just get War Turtle out. Not, that's fun, I'm just wasting time. Wait, Magnitude is super effective? Alright, well, I'm gonna use a Magnitude on you then, if it was super effective. Alright, never mind, I'm using Magnitude. Maybe Golem did have a move. Gainer boosted? Okay. Nope, I will. Let's just keep Golem out. Let's keep using uh, Magnitude. Magnitude 7. Super effective. Want to use Machop. Alright, I will switch back. Let's go ahead and go to Pidgeotto. Give Pidgeotto a couple levels here, huh? And then let's go ahead and use Aerial Ace. There we go. Super effective. Good, good stuff. Defeated Biker Lenny. Uh, let's head down to this guy now. For an encounter with Onyx. Nope. Never mind. Skirt. battle with this guy and I think we should be coming near the end of this hopefully please tell me you only have a couple three all right bud yeah see onyx that's that's what I'm looking for give me one of those I want one of those give me one of those Ooh. thank you all right onyx Nah, let's just keep let's keep War Turtle out. War Turtle's he's a he's just a good tight matchup for everything in this cave, so I might as well just keep him out. War uh, War Turtle was basically built for caves at this point. Geo dude, okay, another rock Pokemon. Okay, another water gun. There we go. Defeated Hiker Oliver. And we made some monies. Alright, there should be an item over here, Onyx. No. The Zubat. Always love the Zubats. Which reminds me, we need to evolve ours to a Golbat eventually. I'm just putting that off because. Ooh, that was like a five-step encounter. Right, another Machop. Go ahead and bite this one. Chomp. Oh, it's not very effective. Clear. Alright, well, not like it's gonna get a chance to attack, so that's, that's cool with me. Sorry, Machop. I've already... I've already got him a champ. And he has four arms instead of two. So... Jokes on you. 
outsiders like you need to show me some respect. But I don't know about that one, man. Two? Alright. Your two better Pokemon better be pristine if, you, if you're trying to get me to show you some respect. It better be pristine. Alright, give me like a level 40 Onyx, huh? Graveler? Hey, honestly? Nobody else I've seen has had a Graveler. So, maybe a tiny bit of respect, but like, not really. Narrative Golem. Level 34. There we go. Defeated Lucas. Alright, does this take me out? Okay, no, we're still... So now we're on floor one. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's nothing up here, but I'll double check. Okay, Geodude. And we got a couple more trainers to fight up here, sadly. There's a lot of trainers in that rock tunnel. Like, a lot of trainers. More than usual. A rugged rock. Okay, so I need to come back here when I get smashed. Wonder if I should. I mean, I feel like I should just be running away from these, but I feel bad for running away because it's basically free XP, you know? And I'm gonna have to level up War Total anyway, so instead of doing it later, I could just take time and just do it now, you know? Okay. Where are we? Okay, so we're down there. We're on floor two. Yeah, I moved a single tile up and... Okay, that's fine. Um, Onyx. Alright. That is cool. Alright, um... I'm gonna bring... Wait, will I kill it with Cut? Will I... Okay, I'm very scared I'm gonna kill it with Cut. But I shouldn't, right? Cut won't kill it. Okay. You never know, like... Honestly, even that is, like... Pretty nuts, though. Okay, there we go. Alright, Onyx. The 5%er. Let's go ahead and catch you, and then we could... Hopefully get out of this stupid cave. Alright, let's go ahead and just, uh, let's, let's use our Great Ball here. I, I don't feel like having this Onyx escape. We'll go ahead and shove our Great Ball at it. Oh, really? That's a little annoying. Hopefully I don't, it doesn't escape four more balls, because I only have four. I can't use another cut or I will kill it. Alright, well, hey, um, three more three more chances here. Three more chances. Oh no. Alright. Um What can we do? To increase the odds, I need I need a, a status effect. I need a status effect. It's gonna hurt a little bit, but not really. Whatever. I guess we just. Oh, we have two more. Okay, two more. Sorry, I thought I had one more chance. Come on, dude. Oh, wow. Okay, this Onyx is actually making me pretty mad now. Like, that's nuts, man. Come on. Like, really? Don't... Don't... Watch me, like, encounter a shiny on the way out. Like... Wow. I, I'm actually, like... For, like, I'm very, very frustrated. You got... You gotta be kidding Your accuracy is going to be lowered because you're dumb. Alright, well, we're going to come back, buy Pokeballs, and find another Onyx because 
were dumb. I didn't bring enough folk. I think this might be the most annoying Onyx I've ever seen in my life. Come on. Alright, we'll have to come back with, um... Some more Pokeballs. How many more people do I have to fight? I'm really not in the mood for fighting anymore. I'll just be one hunted. Alright, looks like we gotta fight four more. Four more fights, man. Oh, no. Sophia. Okay. Alright, Sophia. Dude, I'm literally... I might just, like, do this and just not talk and just, like, go to sleep. I'm almost out of water guns, too. Did you? No. Go ahead and bite the Pidgey. There we go. Use Meow. Okay, we will bite the Meow, too. Alright, bite the Meow. You just threw money at me. Well, now you're gonna get tackled. That's what you get for throwing money at me, dude. And again, I just hope to God I don't encounter a shiny. I mean, the chances are low. But like, if I do, I will cry myself to sleep. Like, actually. You never in any Pokemon game want to just be out of balls. That's like the worst fate you could have. But I have to do it for a little while. When you're up on the Rocky Mountain like this, rock slides are a threat. Can you imagine? Boulders tumbling. They'd be like, wow, you don't seem to be scared. Want to try rock slide? Or only once. Is that okay? Yeah. Which Pokemon? What about my champ? Actually, Nido King might be able to use it. Yeah, let's see. What move can he delete? Um... Probably get rid of Horn Attack here. Alright, cool. Might be scared to use it in this tunnel. Okay, I just won't use it in the tunnel then. Okay, is there anything up here? Okay. Max Ether? Okay. Also, you're not gonna do it just because I don't feel like dealing with anything anymore. Let's go ahead and uh, use a Repel here. So we can get through the rest of this cave with hopefully um, not too many more interruptions. Because no matter what I do, I just don't have balls. So like, right, like why, why would I want to face things knowing I don't have any bore balls? Right. Hopefully, you have a Pokedex, I want one too. Hopefully the last guy of this stupid cave. He has three. Let's get him over with, bud. Let's get him over with. Alright, let's go ahead and bite him. Chomp. Super effective. And from here, we'll get to Labrador Town. Kind of sick. Do you slow poke? I'll keep War Turtle out. We'll just keep biting them. Just like a shelter bites on the tail of a slowpoke. Okay. Okay. Now let's go ahead and chomp on one more slowpoke. Chomp. Alright, and I think that is the last trainer 
of this cave. Hopefully. No! I've been scooped. I've. I've. Oh no, there's more. There's more trainers. <laughs> no, dude. Dude, saying ain't so. Diana's about to use Pidgey. And I think, actually, I think our War Turtle, doesn't it evolve at 36? Or is it 38? I'm pretty sure War Turtle evolves after this match, and it's our last one out of the cave. I'm out of Pokemon. Yes, we do actually get our Blastoise here. What? War Turtle is evolving? Amazing. We get our War Turtle. We get our Blastoise. Man, I'm tired. What time is it? Oh, it's 11.30. Okay, well, that probably explains it. I, I was tired at 8.30, so... Amazing. Got a Blastoise. Congrats. Your War Turtle moment to a Blastoise. Repels wore off. Okay, that's fine. Um... Nothing over here. Don't be shiny. Okay, just a stupid Zubat. Let's see what Blastoise looks like. Cool. Yeah, that's not actually that's not a bad sprite. Again, a lot of the sprites I'm not a big fan of. Like uh, both Golem and Machamp, I, I really don't like their sprites. But eh, what are you gonna do? I just feel like when they were designing them, they definitely could have like, put, like five more minutes into it and be like, yeah, we could probably make a better sprite for this, like realistically, but. Alright, question. So now we get to Route 10. But, honestly, dude, right now, I need to just get... Here's guys, we're gonna come back. No, I was gonna say, we're gonna come back and fight these guys. Um, never mind, guys. We'll just, let's just, let's just take care of it. Let's just fight them. Okay, we got those four done. I think this is Lavender Town. Here's what we're gonna do. We're not gonna do anything crazy. We're ending the episode. But let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon. Let's go buy some balls. Let's go look for an Onyx. And then we're done. I swear, and then we're done. Because, oh lord almighty, I am done for today. All right, the Mart is over here and I, I can't deal with Lavender Town at uh, night, so that's just... We'll, we'll deal with Lavender Town in the morning. Oh, we can buy Great Balls! Alright, let's go ahead and buy 15 of those. And if the Onyx wants to break out of those, then um, we're gonna have a problem. Um, Super Pelts? Buy like four of those, actually. Might want some of those. And we still got 35k in the bank. And we'll go ahead and keep that 35k there. Oh, okay. Here we go. 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 Alright, we got an Onyx. Um, honestly, man, here, just. Yeah. Just stay in the ball. Um, I don't even know what status effects I can use on it. Um, it's gonna bring out Needle King. Or he could probably use Cut. Get it a little lower. And I swear, if Needle King crits and kills it, I. What time is it? Almost on 40. Oh, Needle King, you absolute piece of poop, dude. If that was your second hit and you critted, Lord, oh, and it's poison now. Oh, all right. Well, we gotta catch it in like two turn, two three turns, or it's gonna die. All right, here we go. Time. The clock is on time. The time is on the clock. One. Okay. 
Doesn't want to stay in the ball. Alright, Onyx. You have almost become officially like my third most hated Pokemon of all time. Like, only legendaries should be this hard to catch. Holy. Alright, come on, big snake, rock snake. Let's go, dude. Alright, an hour and 13 minutes later. As it grows, the stone portions of its body harden to become similar to black-colored diamonds. Dude, you can go in my box and you can stay in my box, big dude. For real. Alright. Let's head back to Lavender Town. Let's get out our bike. Alright, guys. This will be the end of this episode. Next episode, we'll go ahead and continue with Lavender Town and... Whew, I need some sleep. So I'll see you guys later.